All right, thank you very much. Good morning. I am Olia Schaefer. I am the founder of the Athletica's personal training studio over in Gulfport. A um, little bit of facts about me. Uh, my family is from Ukraine. I came to the States when I was little and I grew up in New York. Uh, is anybody else from New York or New Jersey? Oh, look at that. Okay. All right. Um, I went to Stuyvesant High School, uh, NYU Stern School of Business, and uh, Talon Law School. I've been married for 16 years to my husband, Robert. He is an Army Special Forces vet, also an entrepreneur. And I have a dog named Maggie who always looks hideous in pictures, but she's really sweet. And uh, we moved to St. Pete in 2014 when my husband retired from the Army. I still work full-time in tech, so when you see me here running out, it's because I have a daily tech meeting. Uh, and uh, so the gym is a passion project that I'm hoping will become full time really soon. At Y Fitness, I, I wasn't really fit as a kid. I didn't do a lot of sports, but as an adult, I really just started to get into it and I love it. I feel much better than when I try to diet myself into skinny. And I just wanted to bring that to other people to feel really, really good. To, and also to be able to control your body, to not just have things happening to you, but to know how to get stronger, how to cure pain, how to get yourself out of weird cramps and strange feelings. And that really kind of inspires me. It makes me feel great that I can make people feel really good and to do meaningful work. Uh, so what is The Athleticus? We are a personal training studio. We are focusing strictly on one-on-one -on -one or one-on-two training. Uh, we are tailored to your needs. We ask people their goals and we work towards them. For some people, that's weight loss. For some people, it's injury rehab. Uh, sometimes it's strength. It just really depends what you are looking to do. And what separates us uh, are a couple of things. Number one, we don't do open gym. So when you're training with us, there are not people coming in and out doing their own thing. Uh, the maximum amount of people training is four, so it's always private. You're always uh, really paid attention to, and uh, every single person has two coaches, so you are always paired with people who have the skill set for what you need. Oh, that was my husband modeling right there. Um, so we are focusing on also creating new programs for people. As their goals change, we change programs every four to six weeks. So you're not written a program for that you just keep going on. As things change and you progress or not, we make sure to alter your program for you. So I wanted to introduce you guys to a client of mine. Uh, this is Alicia Bixler. She is the owner and operator of How's Your Day Honey. She is a beekeeper and a bee rescue um, person who focuses on bee removal and saving bees. And Alicia may not seem like a typical personal training client, but her work is extremely physical. So I'll let her talk a little bit about what she does, and then I can tell you a little bit of what we do to help someone like Alicia, who is a busy mom of three, a business owner, um, and a beekeeper. Yeah, so I'm Alicia. It's so nice to be here. I rescue unwanted bees from commercial property and residential homes. I work with a lot of tree companies, pest control companies. I get a lot of calls from all over, lawn care too. And we also provide honey from the rescued bees at all over Tampa Bay. So why does someone like Alicia need personal training? Um, she's super busy, her days are packed. So she doesn't really have time to go to the gym and figure things out or kind of see what's available, which machine is free. Um, but for someone whose work is super physical, she does really need to be strong. Yes. So tell us a little bit about what you do that does require strength, because people may not know that beekeeping is a very physical job. Very labor intensive. So in the honey business side, I am lifting 50 pound honey boxes for about 10 hours a day. Often on the, the colonies of bees, I have over 100 colonies. So it's, it's very heavy. So I need to be strong. Then in the bee relocation business, I'm climbing up trees, big ladders, cutting open soffits, using tools. I have to be strong. Yeah, so Alicia carries uh, large amounts of equipment on ladders, so she has to be balanced. She has to be strong. She has to feel like she can work overhead. So for her, we wrote programs that involve deadlifts. So if you would model a deadlift sure. for me. So we call this her B-box lift. It's really <laughs> a med ball uh, squat and lift. 
So for someone like her, teaching proper lifting techniques, getting used to lifting overhead. Um, we also do step ups to mimic climbing ladders. Mm -hmm. You got heels on? No. Nope. Okay. Nope. So we do step ups with a med ball or with a dumbbell to mimic climbing with equipment. So we train people to their job to make sure that their goals are met. Someone like Alicia is focusing on overhead work. So we do a lot of overhead presses, dumbbell presses, things that involve lifting and practicing overhead. Do you have anything else you want to share about your work at The Athleticist um, or beekeeping that people may not know? Oh, be well, since I've been with The Athleticist, I am stronger. Uh, it is easier to lift the boxes, which is really nice. And I mean, I feel great. I think that's a big thing is that, you know, you go for strength, but then you get that return of feeling yeah. so good and confident and it's such a good investment. Thank you. Does anybody have any questions for me as a personal trainer or for Alicia as a bee rescuer? Adam. Oh, uh, you can go to my website. It's my business is called How's Your Day Honey? And it'll show you where. I got to go and visit and it's absolutely amazing. And I got to wear a little bee suit. That's me. Um, <laughs> and I'm going to come back up to uh, a slide above here. So howsyourdayhoney.com is Alicia's site. You can buy honey. If you also need bee removal services, you can talk to her. She's fantastic. Any other questions or comments? OK, I will wrap up. Thank you, guys. Um, if you have any questions for me or Alicia, catch us after the, sh the show. <laughs> after the meeting. Thank you.